So this person asks a very relevant question for this time right now being um, college application time. Um, I have my college placement audition next week. I've never ever done anything as serious as this and I don't know if the level that I've prepared the excerpts will be to what they want or where the other cellists will be with the excerpts. I guess my question is do you have any advice for dealing with these feelings? Thanks. Um, well, I can tell you already what they want, that what they want is just like every other audition, they want, you know, they want you to play in tune, they want you to play, um, with good tempo, and they, and they want you to play, um, with good tone, and you can't worry about where, where other people are at, because then you're not concentrating on yourself. And that's who you need to concentrate on, is yourself, right now. That's the only person that matters in this audition, is you. Because you are the one playing for those judges, and you can't worry about the other people because you can't control that. You can't worry about things that are outside of your control. What's inside of your control is playing these excerpts to the absolute best of your ability and with the absolute best knowledge. Basically, how I kind of think through excerpts is I want to sound like I've played this symphony or this overture on tour all summer and I'm almost sick of it and I could and you could wake me up at 2 a.m. and I'll play it. Perfect. That's how you want to feel about it. You want, And you want to and you want it to sound like you've played it in an orchestra before and not like it's a solo piece. Because it's not. It's, you're part of a bigger picture and it has to sound like that. Um, so, I don't know what excerpts you're doing, but um, I'm just going to use, because uh, I'm doing excerpts right now, an audition. Um, when you do Brahms Symphony 2, you got to remember that the chords are really romantic and there's notes and it's very thick and um, you have to listen to the harmonies and like, you know, get your loudest speaker and put on like Vienna Phil and play it with them and put on like New York and play it with them and Boston and play it with them. and. And, and that's how you have to practice it once you have the notes down. And it's really hard. It's a lot harder than what you think it's going to be. Um, but yeah, pretty much worry about yourself and make it sound like um, it's part of a bigger picture and not a solo piece. That's, that's the biggest thing. Hope y'all have a nice day. Please ask me more questions. I'd really appreciate that. I like doing this. I can't promise at any sort of frequency with these, but whenever someone asks me a question that I feel like I want to go more in depth with, um, I'll make a video and put it on uh, YouTube and subscribe. All that, all that jazz. Have a nice day. Bye.